Here's Johnny. I just got done watching The Shining again. It has, it's been years since I saw that movie. It's a great movie. Anyways, that's besides the point. I just wanted to drop some information, what I'm doing tomorrow for you, and some in, in, very interesting and very useful points to get more traffic and alternative ways to profit online, plus a very uh, cost affordable way to, um, cost affordable way to get content done for you instead of writing it out yourself okay so right now I'm currently reviewing watching a course called bloggy by the same people that helped me put out my course traffic revival and Stefan Stefan Cianciano and uh, Greg Kaneko I believe I believe that's their last names uh, they they have some interesting points within the bloggy method okay I want to talk more about this tomorrow but uh, one of the interesting points to talk about is uh, Tailwind, and I use Tailwind myself. You don't need Tailwind. Tailwind, by the way, is a scheduling service and and Pinterest account analyzer, letting you know how to and when you should pin your post, your Pinterest post. But I I blew up on on my Pinterest baby shower account way before I started using Tailwind. I use Tailwind now because it's a time saver. But uh, yeah, that's this is definitely a great tool, but not necessary. That being said, if you can, I will definitely, if you're interested in getting real Pinterest traffic without investing too much time, then definitely Tailwind is something you want to do. I'm going to talk more about this tomorrow, Tailwind. Um, not only do I use Tailwind on a regular basis, on a daily basis nowadays, because I want to get all my pins scheduled, but I also, I, I'm the owner of a very popular um, Tailwind group, what's called the Tailwind Tribe. A lot of a lot of members there. But anyways, that's besides the point. I'm going to talk about that tomorrow. So what else did I learn about Bloggy? Uh, there's nothing. I'm not selling anything here. I just want to talk about what I've learned so far. Just the broad points of Bloggy. They also talk about blog outreaching. Now, what's blog outreaching? This is what blog outreaching is. It's you emailing, contacting other other bloggers in your niche and tell them and asking them I'm just giving you the the broad structure asking them uh, to link back to your content now there there's a there's a right way of doing this you just can't be spamming people because no one's gonna reply to you okay there's a very intelligent way to do this really important way to do this okay this is a great way you want to do this once in a while to get backlinks legit white hat backlinks pointing back to your site okay this will raise your your rankings for the keywords you're trying to you're trying to target the keywords you want to rank for on Google right backlinks do help the way I do SEO I, I make it so that I really hit those low competition keywords so I don't need that so I don't need that that much back those many backlinks but backlinking does help uh, and Blog outreaching is a really smart way. I'm going to talk more about this tomorrow. Okay, so you're going to want to watch the video tomorrow. I'm sending out. I'll be talking about Tailwind and blog outreaching. I won't be talking about The Shining. Don't worry about that. Uh, here's an example of a post I did on, a, on someone else's site, SEO Chat. You scroll down, you'll find the link to my site. Okay, this is a backlink to my site, improving my rankings online. Okay, so more about blog outreaching tomorrow. And another point that uh, they talked about with Bloggy. By the way, Bloggy is a great course. It fits perfectly with what I do. Uh, if you ever, if you've seen my traffic revival course and you're a member, then Bloggy will uh, reinforce and teach you other things that will work uh, in unison with the methods and the techniques I talk about within traffic revival. Okay. Now another thing that Bloggy talks about is outsourcing. Outsourcing again. This is there's a right way and a wrong way to do it. There are a bunch of people here who who uh, will create junk content. So you got to be very careful on how to um, on how to find the right on the right the right writers that will create the content you want at a very cost affordable way. Okay. So I want to talk more about that tomorrow. Uh, but Fiverr is a great resource if you want to, if you're too lazy to write the content yourself. I know sometimes in the baby shower niche, especially, 
uh, I'm a little bit lazy and sometimes I, I will hire someone off of Fiverr to do it for me, okay? More about that later. And AdSense. Now AdSense, I profit off of AdSense too. Um, I'm not showing my AdSense revenue here because uh, there's a strict there, there's a strict uh, rule that you can, if you're an AdSense um, if you if you profit off AdSense you can't show your earnings on uh, you can't show your AdSense earning on YouTube if I'm not mistaken um, I remember that 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 uh, I got a strike for that for showing my revenue on AdSense but I do profit off of AdSense AdSense as well and Bloggy talks about that as well okay so um, I have experience with uh, a lot of the techniques and, and, and methods they talk about within Bloggy, okay? There's a whole review about it coming tomorrow. So I'm really excited to talk about, I'm really excited to show you and all that, show you what the method is all about. But these are some of the big takeaways. The use of a scheduler like Tailwind to capitalize on Pinterest traffic. And at the same time, at the same time, not using a lot of your time pinning you know throughout the day okay if you're not if, if you're if you're not using a scheduler like tailwind then you will have to pin it manually okay throughout the day I, that's what i used to do and uh, i used to do that so i know it works but and if you're a newbie and you want to and you don't want to spend any money on pinterest just pure free traffic you can do it too just like i showed you traffic revival just keep to your schedule but tailwind does help okay blog outreaching is a great way to get uh, backlinks to your site okay as, as you can see here is one example of mine okay and uh, also Fiverr an excellent place to, to get content made for you for, for your for your site uh, very cost-effective too. You gotta find the right writers right and again AdSense another way okay you can't be a one-trick pony you can't have one way to profit online you can have multiple ways you can have your own product your own digital product you can have ads on your on different types of blogs. You can have ads on your YouTube videos, right? You can have CPA offers, cost per action offers, where you send your traffic to another squeeze page, and uh, if they opt into that squeeze page, you get a you get a certain amount. Okay, depends on maybe three bucks a lead, case by case. But Google Ads is definitely a good one. Okay, so that's it. That's what um I just want to let you know real quick. Um, if you if you're into watching a good oldie, good movie. Then it's a shining. If you want to save some time, then it's Tailwind with Pinterest uh, traffic. If you want backlinks, I recommend uh, outreaching. And if you want content written done uh, for very cheap, written for you for very cheap, then I, I recommend Fiverr. So I'll talk to you later. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. I'll be providing tomorrow, actually. Um, I'm, I'll be reviewing Bloggy, and I'll be creating very specific bonuses for that. But uh, but more than that, I'll be showing you, be talking about these different topics, okay, to help you get more traffic and to help you get more uh, to get more profit from the tra from the traffic you get, okay. So take care, and I'll talk to you later. Bye bye.